Hey there guys, um, we haven't recorded in a while because obviously um, we've been waiting on parts but something arrived the other day and uh, well it arrived this morning actually this is the new front end, I know it doesn't look like much at the moment it's a, car it's a wooden box or a cardboard box but hopefully uh, we'll get it out of there and we'll put it in the sun, it's a bright boiling day today and then hopefully that will replace the front end there so that'll be nice. So we'll, we're going to move, get that out of the box now, and uh, yeah, we'll crack on with that. This is what we were sent. This is the new front end to the car. And that's going to go where that, <laughs> those two pieces of front end are. <laughs> so uh, yeah, I guess that's our job for today, is to uh, take off the old one and put this new one on. Look at this bad boy. This end I think is a little bit bent out at the moment, we can just put it back in. We are so lucky to have found one of these though. So lucky. So yeah, that's our job for today. So there we go, that's one side off at least. It's, it's hard work on a day like today, very hot. But um, yeah, no, we managed to get it off. Fred Wan, mostly responsible. I just came in at the last minute and kicked like a superhero and it fell off. <laughs> but yeah, he was hard at work with the grinder and uh, we got these 50-50. I know, I'm just going to claim all the credit for the superhero kick. Uh, this, These tools that we've been um, lent, uh, they were made by my dad and they've come in a lot of use, 100% both of these. Um, I think he said they were 43 years old. So for them to be getting a use again is uh, pretty awesome. But yeah, we've used them to get rid of uh, this side. We've still got the other side to do. Uh, we've learnt a lot from this side, though. I think we're going to be able to do the other side a bit easier. Um, there's a bit of stuff that needs cleaning up up here. We might have to put a new panel, uh, a few new little panels in, uh, just to cover up some of the damage. It's just where it's been rusty, I think. And no, just where we've the, done it with the grinder a little bit. Yeah, that's where it's just we bent it and that, and it all comes away. Yeah, but the uh, we'll tidy that up, get rid of all this surface rust up here, and uh, then we'll put the new panel on. We'll probably just if we can get this other one off today, we'll just clamp it in place to see how it looks, because we have obviously haven't got the welder here at the minute, but uh, we will do soon. So we'll be able to get that all done and dusted. It's going to be very nice. So yeah, see you when the next one's done. Bye bye. You alright? How you doing? We uh, we just thought we'd show you this. How awesome is that? Doesn't even need to be uh, held in place by anything at the second. It's just resting on all the previous points. Look at this bad boy. It just fits. This is now going to be the right height, so the bonnet will shut properly. There's a thing, there's a bit of strengthening here, like there was on the old one. I think we removed that so the radiator would fit, and we put our own one in that wasn't uh, the right length, um, or something. So, oh no, we had the bars down here. We had bars down here, and they weren't at the right height. But um, yeah, just look at this. Is that not amazing? And then when the radiator goes in there. Are the holes in the right place? Yeah, well, there you go. Oh my word. <laughs> That's fantastic. <laughs> She's back, bro! I'm super excited. You guys have got no idea. Me and Fred are quite, quite happy with this. I'm well pleased, nice work bro. Fred worked hard to get this other side off, I just sat and chilled out because I was getting a bit of a headache. But uh, Fred was on it and he did it. And now look at the result. Are you are you proud of your work sir? I am. Fantastic. I am proud of your work as well, it looks incredible. Thank you very much. You are awesome. So there you go guys, that is the front end on. We're gonna We're gonna weld it as soon as we grab a welder. And then we'll uh, then we'll paint everything, I guess. And then put the engine back in, and then hopefully everything will be sweet as. So uh, yeah, there you go, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Bye bye.
Hey there guys, we are back and uh, it's a couple, it's been a couple of weekends since we filmed, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, it's maybe. Um, sorry, I didn't mean to talk well, over you then. Maybe last weekend when we did the first bit of welding. Yeah, yeah, last weekend we, yeah, last weekend we showed the front end sort of fitting on and we did a bit of welding then and then today, uh, and yesterday, Fred has got on with the rest of the welding, so as you can see, quite secure on there now and uh, he's also been busy at work putting filler over the areas that we're going to paint um, as well as well over the other side as well we still need to sand it down obviously but there you go it's all fitted and uh, I think the next step after this is like masking up and stuff isn't it so. sanding down masking up all that good stuff Fine, you're looking at me as if that's your Dr Pepper I think that's your Dr Pepper I think mine's <laughs> on the boot of the car um, but yeah <laughs> yeah um, so yeah I think oh we've uh, I have been I haven't really been busy at work, it's too hot to be busy. Fred's a m As I was trying to say before I turned the camera off, Fred's a machine, I don't know how he does all the work in this heat, but um, I, I just tidied up the inside of here to make it easier. We've removed all the sort of non-essential stuff, so if we, if we have to leave quickly, like if we have to throw the car back together in a hurry, uh, all the essential stuff is easily accessible and we're not bogged down by stuff like um, just trim and things like that whereas uh, obviously we need stuff like the clutch and uh, wing mirrors and radiator and all stuff like that handy so we can if we have to drive the car out of here but um, that makes it sound stolen the car's not stolen I promise you the uh, but yeah we are we're getting on I think I've zoomed in as well I don't know how to use this camera I'm terrible when I'm not behind a desk I mean please zoom out I can't do it I don't know what I'm Totally useless. But anyway, thank you very much for watching, guys. And, uh, yeah. Next week, hopefully, we'll have a spot of paint on her. You never know. Or prep work. Probably prep work next week, and then uh, the weekend off that paint. But, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. See you soon.